Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing this neon skull makeup tutorial for Halloween. And I was really inspired by James Charles. He did a look very similar to this. And he used like blue instead of like the pinks and purples that I use today. So if you want to see how I got this look, then just keep on watching. I'm going to start working it all over the crease. Going in with the BH Cosmetics, this shade right here. And I'm going to go back in with the MAC 224 brush and blend everything, all the edges. But going in with this bottom right black shade, we're going to go out here in the outer corner, light hand, place it in the outer crease, and then work it up a little bit right here. And I'm going to blend out the edges. And just keep blending. And I have no extra product on my brushes. It was the one time that I got into that black and it's pretty pigmented. I'm gonna start right here in the corner. And come back down. I'm gonna create that crease where your natural crease is, or you can bring it a little above, like how I did, and then kind of just work it in. Make sure that line is sharp. I'm going in with this white shade right here at the bottom right. I'm gonna set that concealer. I'm going in with the 217 brush, the same one. I'm just gonna blend the edges and then come in like this right on the edge. A little above. I'm gonna go in with the MAC Ready to Party. Blend out the edges again. And now I'm going to clean things up with a makeup wipe. I'm gonna go in with the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner and I'm just gonna hug the lash line super thin line. Okay guys, I went ahead and did my eyebrows and face makeup off camera just so we could save a little bit of time since the skull part is going to take a little bit of time. You can check out how I did my foundation routine in my last videos. So I'm going to go ahead and finish off the eyes. We're going to start with this purple shade right here. And I'm just going to go underneath my lash line. Blending brush. This is the Morphe R39, and I'm gonna go underneath. I'm gonna go underneath a little bit with the pinkish shade from before, and I'm gonna go back into the Extra Dimension Ready to Party by Mac eyeshadow and I'm gonna come right 
in here. Now I'm gonna go in with MAC Extended Play Giga Black Mascara. I'm picking up the pink shades that we went in with before for the eyeshadow and I'm just gonna blend everything in I'm gonna take a Morphe M22, I mean a MAC M228 brush. I'm going in with the same two pink shades. I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side and I'll be right back. So now we're actually gonna go into the purple, the darker purple shades that we used before in the BH palette. Tap off the brush. Okay, so I went ahead and did it on both sides, added the purple a little bit on my nose, and now we're going to go in with the black eyeshadow that we got to be pretty careful about. So I'm going in with the Jaclyn Hill, that black eyeshadow we picked up before, tapping off the X's, make sure. And I'm just going to come into these like gaps so that we're going to cover up like the skin tone. My skin tone. gonna go in with that MAC 228 brush the one we had the purple on and we'll go into the black and now I'm going to take the M515 by Morphe it's a really like small detailing brush and we're gonna go into the spaces that are white between like our teeth. MAC 230 on the areas up here that I didn't blend out too well. Blend the black into the pink. It's clean, so. Let's see how that looks a little bit better.
And I'm actually gonna go in with this brush again and MAC 212. I'm gonna pick up a little bit. Poor molar feels like little heart. How cute. Okay guys, so this is what it looks like when you do all the teeth. So where we have the pink, we're gonna go in between with the white. And I'm not too excited about this just because you have to have such a steady hand and patience, but we're gonna get through this together, okay? And I forgot to tell you guys, don't breathe while you're doing this. I'm just kidding, but I mean, I'm not. Okay, now I'm gonna do the other side. I'll be right back. Okay guys, so now I'm going, oh God, this looks so funny when I smile. Uh, so now I'm going to apply the Coco Goddess Lashes. They come in like this box and they are this style. You can see it. And I'm just gonna wait for the lash glue to dry a little bit and I'm just gonna pop them off. This is what they look like before. Okay guys, I'm going to go fix my hair. Let's get this my drawers opened. I'm gonna fix my hair like a little bit and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys the final look. Okay guys, that completes this makeup tutorial. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will be having more videos coming soon. And please feel free to comment down below what videos you would like me to do next and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. to me <laughs> feel overly dramatic with this makeup look I mean a Halloween look whatever